Big brother thinks he's gonna have some fun. I'm gonna have some fun too. Nice. What are you doing, you idiot? I'm Andrew. I'm Kevin. Welcome, Welcome to Brojax. <laughs> this weekend, we've decided to build the ultimate swim raft. Yeah, I am pumped about this project. It's going to be awesome. Any other time I've been on a swim raft, it's, yeah, it's all right. You get out there, you hang around for a few minutes, and then you, you leave, basically. We're trying to make this so that you're able to go out there and stay and uh, really have no want out there. If you're hungry, you got something. If you want a beverage, it's there. So it's a long weekend. We've got three days to build the ultimate swim raft. We've got a simple eight by 16 foot platform and we're gonna put five barrels per side to give us our pontoon style flotation. On top of the platform, we're gonna build a pergola. We're gonna use four by fours as the uprights with two by six cross braces. We're gonna need seating as well as storage. So a couple of rectangular boxes should accomplish both. The plan is to stay on board for long stretches. So both a barbecue and a drink cooler are mandatory. We're gonna put a couple hammocks on board as well as some hooks for our fishing rods. To get moving, we're thinking of installing an electric trolling motor. To accompany that, a solar panel table. This is an ambitious weekend build, but if we put our minds to it, I think we can do it. It's taken a lot longer than, uh, than we expected. We're flying at it. We've got a lot of daylight left today. Time crunch is on. We've finally finished our little window frame exterior perimeter. It'll look great when you're on it, but uh, we need to skirt it for sure. Junior? Skirt? I don't do skirts, man. It's your thing. And Kevin is going to cut out our notches for our 4x4 four four uprights. We're about two days behind on the decking, but uh, hopefully it'll go fast from here up. Believe it or not, we are both self-trained carpenters. You might not notice that. It's trial and error. All this stuff is trial and error. These are a couple of benches we built to go on the back of the swim platform. Pretty simple, little cedar boxes. You can take off the lid. Inside is where we're gonna keep the battery for the electric trolling motor. And the other one's gonna be dry storage. Not too bad, if I do say so myself. The plexi is going to fit right on top of the solar panel. Little table for the back of the swim raft. I just get the little people to do the work for me after I do the brainstorm. Would you say I'm the little, people. the little people? This is head and shoulders above what the initial thing started out to be. We threw in a lot of extras, like the pergola and the barbecue and the solar panel. But in the end, I think we nailed this one. I'm leaving, man. You coming? I'm out of here. You made it. Whoa, it is. Pretty good. I, I like it. Play some pong. Yeah, I can't wait to destroy it. <laughs>